you know, I'm trying to make a YouTube for all your friends. A YouTube video. You're interrupting. I need to apologize. Sorry, guys. So, welcome back to our channel. Sorry I look like crap, but, you know, we're in life. Anyways, so today I have a bunch of good home hacks for you guys. Especially you ladies, I know you guys have been requesting a lot of them, and especially when I'm at work, people call me the queen of hacks. I don't think I am, but I like to do my research <laughs> when it comes to a clean home. Um, especially having two big dogs that are clearly interrupting right now, so I do apologize about that. Anyways, so I have one, two, three, Fourteen goodies for you guys today that you can use around your house and um, probably one one more thing, but we can get started on the video. Alright, so first are these microfiber cloths. You can get them at the dollar store. Focus right there. So you get a four pack for a dollar. And these are really good for, um, I use them pretty much for anything. You just, you can wet them or you can use them dry. I personally like to use them wet. Um, I use these to clean the baseboards around the house. Um, also you can wet it to pick up all the, it acts kind of like a lint roller, so it picks up uh, more dust than actually a paper towel would. So they're very good for that. So a four pack for a dollar, Dollar Tree, go um, get these. <laughs> right. This one also is from Dollar Tree, you can get it at H-E-B, it's utterly smooth. And this is a lotion, uh, when my mom had uh, cancer, they, whenever she was on her uh, cancer medications, it made her skin really, really dry, and it also made her have this uh, hand-foot disease where it turns your um, hands and your feet black, and it makes and it starts cracking the insides of your hands, your feet, in between your toes, everywhere. Like, your skin just starts cracking just because the medication is so strong. Um, they did um, recommend for her to use this, and she... It, her body just like loved it. It absorbed it completely and it made her her hands and her feet, her feet really soft and it made the healing process a lot faster versus, you know, uh, her feet and her hands uh, being blistered all the time because of all the cracking. It just made her skin a lot smoother with this. So after you get out of the shower, even if you don't have cancer, you know, knock on wood, hope, hope none of you have it. You can use this right out of the shower. You can use it on your heels, especially in the winter. You can use it on your hands, in between, elbows. Don't forget your elbows. There's nothing more that gets on my nerves than seeing people with dry elbows, like crusty elbows. Like, come on, man. Especially dudes. Come on. Scrub, put lotion on. It's a pet peeve of mine. Do it. Dollar store, a dollar. Really good. If not, you can get the big tub at H E B or Walmart. Next, I found these uh, 12 pack for five dollars at T J Maxx, and these are also microfiber sheets, but these are longer. And I like that they're a different color because you can use these for whatever. Uh, specific place that you want to use them for. Like you can use for one for your car, one for your bathroom, and one for your kitchen. So we have three bathrooms in our house. So um, I can just leave one in each uh, drawer and just whenever I need to clean something, I have it there. And I just didn't get confused with someone using the hand towel. So $5.99 for a 12 pack. And these are really good. And they're super soft, so it's not going to damage your um, your granite or anything like that. You, I like using these 
whenever we uh, clean our fridge, which is stainless steel, our stove, and also our dishwasher. I like using the microfiber because it works really well with this next product I'm going to show you. It's called Magic, the brand, and it's a stainless steel wipe. And honestly, I'm on the hunt and trying to find these, but I cannot find them anywhere. So I'm going to have to Google it and try to do more research to see if I can find it online. But I actually got these at TJ Maxx as well. They were $3.49. And these are awesome. Like, I cannot express how awesome these are. Like, you guys need to get one of these. And um, so what we do is we uh, do circular motions on the stainless steel on the fridge and on the uh, stove and also the dishwasher and after we do that we clean it really well but once we dry it off we don't want that streak right you know because you want it clean you get one of your microfiber cloths and you go in circular motions so these are awesome together next uh we're gonna keep kitchen little thing here. So what this is, you're probably wondering what this is. It is a fruit scrubber, cleaner, vegetable. So if you're like me, I have to clean everything, especially with everything going on. You want to make sure that your fruit and your veggies are all clean. Um, once you get back from the store or if you're going to use or eat a product, you know, especially something that you're going to eat the skin with, like an apple, um, like, cu like cucumbers or um, just anything that you're going to eat the skin with, you know. Um, you want to make sure that you burn this under warm water. And you just put your fruit under the water and you just start scrubbing. And it's not gonna hurt the fruit or make any dents or anything on it or puncture it. It's super soft. They're little like plastic, little soft bristles. And they're really nice like to just keep on the countertop. We have a little drawer under our sink, so I just put it in there. But definitely get one of these. Um, I think I got this one at Bed Bath & Beyond. Ours was closing, so I literally got this for like maybe like 50 cents. But it's a really good product to have. I'm pretty sure you can find it at another Bed Bath & Beyond. <laughs> you can come <laughs> or you can um, just maybe you can Google it, like maybe like a fruit um, fruit cleaner, and then maybe you can find one there. But I got this at Bed Bath & Beyond. So if you have one close to you, then you can search for one there. Next, I'm... So I use this, Mrs. Myers. This is the best. Well, I have two sets. I have the um, honeysuckle, and this one is the peony one. It smells so good when you're cleaning your countertops. Um, it's I don't know. To me, it's like one of the best ones, um, especially like when you're cleaning. You want your house to smell good, right? Not only do you want it to be clean, but you want it to smell good. And I love this. I give this to my best friend for her housewarming gift, and she loves it. All right. This. Resolve. It's a carpet uh, pet stain cleaner. Come on, focus. There you go. So, what you do with this... Alright, so I have a video, so I'm going to insert a clip once I'm done with this, talking to you about, about this. Um, you spray it on the grout. So you spray it, leave it for about maybe like a minute or so. You spray it on the grout and everything because obviously you can clean your tile as much as you want, but as, as long as your grout is black, your tile is just going to look dirty. So. You literally, what this is going to do is going to pick up all of that nasty gunk that's inside the grout. And you can go with one of these. 
So it's a little bamboo brush. The bristles are pretty rough. So what that's going to do, you don't have to go with like a toothbrush or anything. I didn't mind with the toothbrush because I didn't have this. And I have one on my countertop, but I'm not going to use that one because that one is for aesthetic. So I got another one just so I can use this specifically for our grout. And you just go scrub it in circular motions and you'll see how the tile is going to look after you insert the video. So this is amazing like you don't just have to use it on carpet you can use it on the grout in your shower or you can use it anywhere that you have tile just spray it leave it on there for it says 30 seconds here five minutes max but i usually leave it for maybe like about a minute um it is an eye irritant so or if you're very sensitive to smells i would suggest you wearing a mask and also some gloves just so you know if you have sensitive skin like me um just use it trust me you're gonna love it and next about cleaning your carpet or tile <laughs> this one here is the uh folex instant carpet remover so there you go guys okay let me tell you guys i love amazon but sometimes it can be a little bit pricey and they have to pay shipping for certain things so what i did so i looked for this because i have a little dog that sometimes she doesn't think that she's potty trained and she does what she wants she's roaming around so i'm looking at her um she had an accident on a very expensive rug <laughs> So I was going to order this on Amazon, but when I Google searched, I saw that I could get it for $10 cheaper at Home Depot or Lowe's. So I better believe I took my butt down to Lowe's or wherever I got it. I think it was Lowe's. Yeah, it was Lowe's. And I got it there for $5 <laughs> instead of $13 plus shipping. So you need to use this like this is amazing and um, you just spray a little bit on the carpet let it sit there don't scrub it for at least maybe like two to three minutes just let it sit there and let it soak in because depending on the um amount of like of the stain that you have on the floor or on a pillowcase or um on your rug then you want to leave it there for as long as you know however deep the stain might be sometimes obviously on a carpet it might be a little bit deeper so you want to let it sit there for a pretty good minute just so that you can be able to pick it up and remove the stain if it doesn't come off on the first try just spray until you receive your the results that you want so folix really good <laughs> all right next so who doesn't want their tub and their toilet or their shower to be clean, right? I mean, I'm the type of person that if I'm going to go to your house and I'm going to use your guest bathroom, I'm going to pick your little shower curtain. I'm going to make sure your house is clean. I don't know. It's just a Hispanic in me. Anyways, I'm filming. What do you want? You want to say hi to, the, to your friend? You want to say hi? Go play with mama. Go play with your brother. All right. So this, you guys saw this on the last haul from our Dollar Tree haul. And this is pretty big, like for a dollar. It's bigger than my head. I have a big head. So this is Ajax and it does have bleach. So you have to be careful with this because you don't want to wear your fancy clothes and then you're cleaning something. You get this on you. You're going to have um, tie dye clothes. Okay. And next, Dawn. You can use any, the off brand, doesn't matter. I just happen to have this one. Anyways, so when you're cleaning your tub, you wanna put, obviously you wanna dilute this with water because it is pretty potent. So again, wear gloves. You don't wanna mess up your hands. Um, fun fact, when my mom had cancer, um, the doctor that was taking care of her, she said, you want to make sure that you wear gloves whenever you're cleaning something. Why? Because our skin 
is like a sponge that absorbs products. You know, when we're cleaning our face, we use products on our face and then we use moisturizer. So what does our body do? It absorbs it, right? So whenever you're using cleaning products, you want to make sure that you're wearing gloves because you don't want this product to go inside your body because your skin's going to absorb it. So make sure you wear gloves. And then also wear a mask because it is bleach and it is strong. So you want to make sure that you don't get your eyes irritated or your skin irritated. Okay. So anyways, um, you want to make sure that you turn on the water faucet. Make sure your tub is wet. You're going to sprinkle a little bit of this on the tub. And then you're going to go with your soap, any kind of soap. Doesn't matter. You pour it. And then you, you're obviously you're going to have water in the tub so you mix that together you get your spot your cleaning sponge or whatever it is that your scrubber whatever it is that you use and you go and you start cleaning and that's going to get all of the gunk on the rim if they take baths or anything you know you get that film after and you're just going to go and clean everything spotless and it leaves it smelling good you feels, it feels clean, the little squeaky sound that you make whenever you go in. Make sure something's clean. Really good for cleaning your bathroom. You don't worry guys, I have a towel to make sure that nothing spills, but everything's sealed. All right, next is, I know that I talked about using these to clean the um, baseboard, but you also, want to use um, whenever you take your clothes out of the dryer you have your dryer sheets right and we just toss them in the trash but one thing that I've come to notice whenever I use this it also acts like a lint roller because it um, what are you doing okay go anyways um, what you're gonna do you can clean your baseboards with it it's gonna take out I have dogs Again, obviously you guys know that, but hairs get on the rim of the baseboard. So what I do is I grab a dryer sheet and I just go and clean the baseboard and all of it just stays on here because it's, it's just going to, it acts like a lint roller, so it's, everything's going to stay in here, just like the microfiber. So if you don't have this, you can use a dryer sheet. Trust me, it works. Also, it works if you're cleaning your um, your sink, like the um, the silver, the stainless steel part of your sink, like your little like uh, nozzle. You go and you just like it shines it. It leaves it super shiny. Trust me, do it. <laughs> but you know, these are best. These are awesome. I mean, all right. Next this one here it it's a um, air fresher it smells so good guys I don't know if that's gonna focus because the letters are pretty small so it's that brand and the scent is lemon you guys I got this at TJ Maxx it's $3.99 it smells so good you don't get that strong lemony scent I'm like obsessed with it it's just like a lemon vanilla scent. It smells amazing. If you guys find this, it's AP Fragrance Lemon Citrus Home Fragrance. So you can find this at TJ Maxx, Home Goods, I'm sure has it, and Marshall. But you guys, and the, the scent lasts. Like I walk into the house, I started earlier this morning when I cleaned the house, and I walked in and I was like, wow, I can still smell this. So it's like a lemon vanilla scent it's not strong but it smells so good and it leaves it smelling so clean like it's not like the other aerosols that are out there and obviously i like those but this smells so good all right so we're gonna our bucket you guys so babe can you come get them My dogs decided to have a play fight while I was trying to film. Anyways, 
so these here probably wonder what these are they are body scrub so it's a it's, it's a loofah but it's like a little round loofah and it has like a little um handle on in the back so you can hold it so i got you can get them at target walmart anywhere but i got these from uh tj maxx they were 3.99 for a two pack so one thing you guys may not know but i do have um uh, uh keratosis pilaris is that what it is is that what it's called you make sure before i give you all the wrong information yes keratosis pilaris so what it is it's those little bumps that you get on your arm and you know obviously nobody wants to have that on their arms and you know it just looks it makes you feel very um like not confident right you know you you don't want nobody touching your arms or anything like that you don't want to wear cutoffs i was like that for the longest time but you know with a little bit of research and making sure that you know you uh are taking care of your body um i came across these and what this is and what it does so you want to make sure that you know it it pretty much takes off like dead skin cells right you know like if you're anytime that you're doing like a body scrub or a facial scrub anything is going to take off the layers of your skin to make it soft and supple so pretty much this is what this is so i use it with um the dial soap not well i used to use dial soap but now i use the dove which i feel like it's softer and it makes my skin uh feel smoother and my the lotion goes on better and absorbs it better so i use now i don't use dove the soap i use the bar i like the bar better and it's the original dove bar soap so, and then i just rub it on here and lather it with water and what you do you go in circular motions and you just scrub wherever your problem area is and anywhere in your arm do it on your legs you know if sometimes if you have like that strawberry skin on your legs especially from shaving um do that it's gonna make your skin a lot smoother and whenever you shave you don't want to shave before you scrub you want to shave after you scrub so you want to go and have a smooth layer first before you shave and then your skin is going to be a lot smoother whenever you shave trust me and so this circular motions i use i use, I do it every day and you just put lotion on after and trust me guys like i have no bumps now it's so smooth you know of course you have to be gentle with your with your skin you know i'll take care of it but it's not it's not rough to the point where it's going to hurt you it's just going to you know make your skin a lot more soft but you have to put a lotion on after like a good cream okay this is really good this one here is a back scrubber so same concept it's a little bit you know it's, it's going to take off that dead skin cell and i like this because it has like the handle so you know you can go behind and just scrub and it's going to make your soft really i mean your back really soft so i'll get this is from um, this is from tj maxx i think i paid three dollars for it so it was very inexpensive and you know these are things sometimes you know you have you can't reach behind there some people you know they might have like a shoulder problem and you can literally just go behind here and just scrub and your your skin will be soft and it'll thank you because it'll be glowing and you know who doesn't want that right you know especially for summer
I hope you guys enjoyed this little home hack and I guess like skin hack as well so if you guys if you guys have any questions or any recommendations please leave it in the comment down below of whatever else you guys want to see or if you want guys want to do like a clean with me then I'd be more than happy to do that with you guys so just let me know leave it on this on the comments below so um, I don't know what else if you guys want to do a house tour uh, let me do that I mean I can do that as well if you guys want to but um, or, or a home hack of everything I've bought to uh, make our house I guess more homier but if you have any recommendations of anything just let me know um, if you have your own home hacks I want to know too so leave it down below and let me know what your hacks are as well so subscribe like and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.